from animals that thrive without air to cockroaches and tardigrades, here are 18 species that can survive the harshest environments. Number 18, Arctic animals. Let's start things off with a beast that epitomizes cold, freezing climates. Polar bears are the world's largest carnivores on land, but since they're so dependent on sea ice, they're classified as marine mammals. While they're the best known animal ambassadors of the Arctic, there are some other cold resistant critters in the region as well. That includes Arctic hares and wolves. Hares keep warm by huddling up by the hundreds. Arctic wolves have two coats that keep the animals insulated. Polar bears manage to resist the cold thanks in part to 10 centimeters, four inches of body fat. They have a thick underfur and a top layer of guard hairs that appear white, but are actually transparent. Number 17, Sonoran Desert Toad. Found from northern Mexico into southwestern US, this semi-aquatic amphibian can measure about 7.5 inches long or 190 millimeters. They can survive in the desert and semi-arid regions and are often found near streams or springs. They're also known as Colorado River Toads, but they might be best known as toads that produce an incredibly powerful poison. Merely inhaling it is said to induce strong hallucinations. Number 16, Red Flat Bark Beetles. These insects inhabit northern regions, including the Brooks Mountain Range in Alaska. As their name suggests, they have flat bodies that measure about 14 centimeters long or five and a half inches and are often found under the bark of dead trees. With the onset of winter, these beetles will expel about 40% of its body water. The remaining fluid is used to produce proteins that enable it to resist freezing as it enters a type of suspended animation. Number 15, Kangaroo Rat. Like their much larger marsupial namesake, these small rodents will hop about in a manner resembling kangaroos. They live in arid and semi-arid regions of North America, often in habitats that are hot and dry. To survive in such conditions, they conserve water by lowering their metabolic rate. That minimizes water loss through their respiratory system and skin. They don't need to drink water at all since they receive water from the metabolic oxidization of the seeds they eat. Number 14, Desert Pupfish. At less than 3 inches long, 7.6 centimetres, these are rare bony fish that can thrive in waters that have extreme salinity, saltiness, pH content and temperatures up to 45 degrees Celsius or 114 Fahrenheit. Those factors, along with low oxygen content in the waters, makes the habitat too deadly for most other fish to survive. In fact, the pupfish seem to be especially abundant in such harsh conditions. Experts say that their adaptation to the hostile environment might serve as a defense mechanism against invasive or non-native fish. Number 13, Desert Tortoise. You might tend to associate a tortoise with aquatic or rainforest habitats, but there are two species of tortoise that can thrive in desert environments where ground temperatures can exceed 140 degrees Fahrenheit or 60 degrees Celsius. The desert tortoise is found in Mojave and Sonoran deserts of the US and areas of northwestern Mexico. They can live up to 80 years and spend about 95% of their lives in burrows or rock shelters where they can stay inactive for most of the year. Their inactivity helps them regulate their body temperature and conserve water during the hottest periods. During the winter, they'll hibernate to survive periods of freezing temperatures and scarce food supplies. Number 12, Bardaloid. These are microscopic invertebrates that are often found in freshwater environments all over the world. And although there are over 450 species of these animals, not one male has ever been detected. All of these creatures are female and reproduced by parthenogenesis, a form of asexual reproduction. They survive by consuming the DNA of other organisms. And that stolen genetic material has given them an amazing ability to survive extreme dehydration. Beyond that, the ability helps them to survive radiation levels so extreme that most other animals would be killed by the exposure. Number 11, Greenland Sharks. Since these big fish inhabit the frigid waters of the North Atlantic Ocean at depths exceeding 1200 meters or 3900 feet, sightings of them tend to be rare. But they're among the world's largest sharks, weighing about 2200 pounds or nearly 1000 kilograms and measuring more than 20 feet long or 6 meters. Thought to be the coldest dwelling sharks, they tend to move slowly to conserve energy. And that ties in with the animal's slow metabolism and impressive longevity. By some accounts, these fish can live for more than 400 years. Number 10, Snailfish. Although there are more than 400 described species of snailfish, there are also many species that remain undescribed. So there are still plenty of question marks regarding this specimen. What is known is that they can be found in a wide range of ocean habitats, and that includes the Mariana Trench at depths exceeding 26,000 feet 
or nearly 8,000 metres. At those extreme levels, the water pressure is crushing and no light can penetrate the darkness. The species found there are referred to as the ethereal snailfish. Number 9. Camel if you think of a desert landscape, the first animal that comes to mind is this critter. There are three surviving species of camel, but the best known is probably the one-humped dromedaries, which can weigh more than 1,300 pounds, 590 kilograms, and are found in Africa and the Middle East. Their body temperature can range from 93 degrees Fahrenheit, 34 Celsius, to around 104 Fahrenheit, or 40 Celsius, which would likely be fatal to other animals and under the hottest conditions, they can survive by drinking water once every 10 days. Their thick coats help insulate the animals from the desert heat, and its colour becomes lighter, reflecting light and preventing sunburn. For the record, camels don't store water in their humps. Those structures are fatty tissues that help insulate the beasts from the heat. Number 8. Wood Frogs These amphibians can be found across North America, from Canada south to the Appalachians. They have a unique tolerance to cold that has caught the attention of biologists. In winter, the frogs will gather some leaves as a shelter, then simply freeze as temperatures plunge. They're actually in a state of hibernation and can withstand the freezing of their blood and tissues thanks to large concentrations of glucose in their liver. It works as a type of antifreeze in their bodies. While their heart eventually stops, the frogs can recover from many freeze and thaw events so long as no more than 65% of their total body water freezes. Number 7. Himalayan Jumping Spider This arachnid lives at elevations upwards of 22,000 feet, 6,700 metres in the Himalayas, including Mount Everest. Considering that the highest permanent human settlement is located in Peru at more than 16,700 feet, or 5 kilometres, these spiders might be the world's highest permanent residence. Experts say the creatures measure about 5 millimetres fully grown and inhabit snowy, icy terrain year-round. These spiders feed on insects that are blown by the wind onto mountain slopes, but it's not entirely known how the spiders themselves arrived there. What do you think? Number 6. Deep Sea Worms These alien-looking creatures are known for thriving in harsh undersea environments. Giant tube worms can be found miles deep on the floor of the Pacific Ocean, living around hydrothermal sea vents that belch out high levels of hydrogen sulfide. Another undersea worm, Parolvanella sulfincola, lives in close proximity to the superheated fluids of hydrothermal vents, where temperatures can exceed 300 degrees Celsius, or 570 degrees Fahrenheit. Number 5. Sahara Desert Ant this insect is known to be one of the most heat-tolerant animals in the world, and considering its native habitat, it would have to be. Foraging on the floor of the Sahara Desert, this ant is known to withstand surface temperatures of some 178 degrees Fahrenheit, 81 degrees Celsius, and it can maintain a body temperature of more than 122 degrees Fahrenheit or 50 degrees Celsius. Pretty amazing considering that no terrestrial animal yet identified can survive permanently at temperatures exceeding 120 degrees Fahrenheit. Still, according to some sources, even these heat-resistant critters might end up frying if they don't keep moving. While foraging in the heat of the day, these insects will use their sense of smell or even count their own footsteps to return home before they overheat. Number 4. Your Friendly Neighbourhood Cockroach there's just no getting away from these unsightly beasts, is there? Many theories concerning their survivability have been postulated. The most famous example of their resilience is how these insects will inhabit the Earth by surviving a nuclear catastrophe. Hopefully we'll never have to find out, but these insects are known for their tolerance to high levels of radiation. Experts say they can withstand up to 15 times the amount that's lethal for most vertebrates. They can survive for weeks without food, go without air for nearly an hour, and live for extended periods after being decapitated. Whether it's tropical heat or arctic cold, these hardy insects seem to take it all in their stride. Did you know there are about 4,600 cockroach species? And about 30 are linked to human habitats. Number 3. Pompeii Worm This species of polychaete worm was discovered in the early 1980s off the Galapagos Islands. Their alien appearance matches their alien habitat since they're only found around hydrothermal vents in the Pacific Ocean. Over 5 feet long, 1.5 metres, they seem to be quite comfortable resting in waters that register as high as 221 degrees Fahrenheit or 105 degrees Celsius for short periods. Experts say that after the tardigrade, this is the world's most tolerant complex animal yet known to science. Its name is a reference to the ancient Roman city of Pompeii, which was destroyed when Mount Vesuvius erupted in 79 AD. Number 2. Tardigrades 
Here's a hardy beast that seems to epitomize the idea of small but mighty. These eight-legged micro-animals have a stout, plump shape that inspires the name water bears. But there's nothing cuddly about their knack for survival. They're renowned for their resilience in all manner of extreme environments. They can thrive on mountaintops or in deep seas, or from rainforests to the Antarctic. Whether it's extreme heat, cold, dehydration, starvation, or intense radiation, tardigrades can tolerate just about everything nature throws at them. That includes surviving in the void of outer space. Did you know that experts say these impressive critters have been around for more than half a billion years? Number 1. Dead Zone Dwellers this microorganism made history when it was described in 2014. While the vast majority of animals need oxygen to survive, this tiny beast does not. It's the first animal species documented that does not require oxygen to survive at any point in its life. Known as Spinalaricus chinzea, experts say its innards are geared for life in a zero oxygen environment. And that's the type of habitat in which it was discovered. It lives some two and a half miles, four kilometers deep under the surface of the Mediterranean Sea, in an area known as the dead zone due to its lack of oxygen. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button and click the bell for notifications for our next exciting episode right here on Epic Wildlife.